welcome to uh, another video by Agricultural Insights. My name is Chris Stelzer. Um, before we get started, I just want to remind you guys, you can go to agriculturalinsights.com and subscribe via email to get all the updates <clears throat> sent directly to your email inbox. So that would be great if you could go over there and do that. Also remember, we do have a Facebook and Twitter page, and you can find all those on agriculturalinsights.com. Okay, so let's get started. Today I want to talk about, um, sort of about litter, but what grassroots can do for you um, in, in terms of building organic matter in the soil and why grazing plants tall, which would be indicated by this plant here, this is what we consider a tall grass plant, medium, short. Um, this is a, my, my crappy animation but hey it works and um, this is not a desert <laughs> it looks kinda like a desert but um, so yeah grazing tall <clears throat> really has a lot of benefits and today I just wanna focus on the root structure which is down here and how you can build organic matter really deep down in the soil and um, so yeah let's get started so a lot of people think that I mean, and this is true to a, a certain extent, that organic matter can only be built by placing organic matter on top of the ground. And then we have, you know, this is one layer of organic matter, this is another layer of or organic matter, and so on and so forth. But actually what you can do is when you graze your plants tall and you bite the plant off, let's say the cow or you know, whatever type of livestock you have, um, a ewe, head of sheep, head of cattle, bites off this much of the grass plant, and they take this grass plant so this is no longer there. What happens is the roots actually reduce in size and scope as well. So essentially you've bitten off this area of the roots as well. And when you bite off this area of the roots, um, well, you can't bite off this area, but when you bite off this up here, this area of the roots, everything down here, okay, everything in this little area starts to de it dies and decomposes basically. And so you're actively building organic matter very deep down in the soil right here, okay? So when this grass grows back, let's say it comes back again, the roots are going to go, um, let me get my mouse here. So the roots are going to go down, 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 you know. These are the, let's say the white strands are the new roots forming. So you're going to get new roots, okay, that have access to this organic matter from its previous root system that's dead. Okay? Um, so that's aerating the soil. That's adding a bunch of fertility and nutrients to the soil um, that you didn't have before. All right, when you bite the plant off about right here. So you can build organic matter in two ways. As described earlier, you can build organic matter from uh, trampling your grass. Wow, that's a bad arrow. From trampling grass on the ground like this, which is essentially carbon, and then that decomposes um, via all the soil critters and moisture uh, and they turn all that good stuff into organic matter for you. And then you can build organic matter down here in this soil surface by having all of these roots start to break down down here. Okay? So, if you were, if you were in a situation where... Excuse me for that. If you're in a situation where your grass plants are about this big that's basically continuously grazed ground. Try and avoid that. If you can get to, uh, let's say next year, when you start implementing some of these ideas and you can get to here with your grass plants, that's absolutely fantastic. You're gonna start building organic matter all in this area of the soil, right? All down here. Um, ideally, you wanna get to this big guy all right, this big guy right here. Um, there's a lot of things, a lot of other things that happen down here beneath the soil. Uh, there's a lot of things that happen with water and minerals. 
Um, but I just wanted to focus today on the grass roots and a little bit of the litter. Um, and I just wanted to explain to you guys how you can build organic matter from deep below, deep down in your soils to create even more fertility than you would think um, possible before. So I hope you guys enjoyed that little video from me. And I look forward to seeing you at agriculturalinsights.com. Um, stop on by. Let me know what you think. And uh, I look forward to hearing from you guys soon. Also remember to subscribe, as I mentioned earlier, via email. And you can do that on the website. And just click on the subscribe tab and it will take you right there. Thank you.